welcome back to my channel today and we are doing a brand new Sims 4 video today and so today we are back better than ever but this time around with yet another shell challenge for the month of May. However, last month was a little bit of a doozy. Required objects, a basement, all the things that were just not, not it. But however, this one is a lot more fun and a lot more creative because you guys actually get to choose a career because my good old friend Daphne, my also moderator in my Twitch channel, she gave me the good idea of actually making this shell challenge career themed. And so what that means is basically you have to choose a career that's in The Sims 4 and based on that career, you have to make a sim and give them a storyline and based on that storyline, you have to implement that story within their career within the shell of it all. And for me, I think that's like a cool idea because one, it gets, it gives you guys a chance to kind of Tell, tell your own story based on how you story tell in the sims but also kind of see what you guys can definitely do with my shell like turn it into a restaurant or a bookstore or a vet clinic or a hospital or a nursing home or a daycare literally anything is possible in the sims 4 when you implement storytelling within the game itself and for me i think that's like more fun because when you don't have a story or you don't have really anything at all the game does get boring so I want to challenge you guys to put your own creative spin to it with a story and a sim and see what you can definitely do with that story with my shell. And for example, let's just say um, the Sims 4 Discovery University, there are three new careers, lawyer, engineer, and teacher. And let's say you have, you know, William Rogers. William Rogers just graduated from Brychester University as a soon to be lawyer in the wonderful world of Newcrest um, Law Enforcement or Lawyer Agency, whatever it's called. Basically, he just graduated from Brychester University and he is going to be a soon to be lawyer, but he's looking for a new place to live or a, a place to like for employment. And let's say you can turn this shell into a, um, what's it called? A lawyer, um, attorney, attorney office. Basically you can turn this shell into an attorney office, make it fun for that sim and see where his life goes for his career. Or you could build a, um, a courthouse or a library or his actual home that he could live in. Like literally the, the possibilities are endless when you implement a story within your Sims game. Cause without a story, you really have nothing. And so like I said, you could turn this to an, uh, into a house, uh, a courthouse, a library, or whatever. It could be literally any career in The Sims 4. Use that career, make a story, make a sim. If that helps you, you don't have to, but it'd be kind of more fun to do it that way. Give Get that story and see what you could do with the shell based on that story. If that makes any sense, all the things will be down below in the description, but also in the comments so you guys kind of understand on what's happening and what the whole rules are and everything. But I will showcase the actual shell in real time and showing guys like what is all entailing basically. So like I said before, this entire shell in itself is basically your own blank canvas and you can do whatever you want with the shell, but as long as you do not touch my walls or add existing walls to my shell like this right here, don't do that because that's touching my walls and making my shell look completely different. But the one thing that you can do or a few things you can do is that you can change the walls into half walls if you want to. You can add spangles if you want to to the shell like this. You could do that if you want to. You can also change the walls by adding fencing if you want to. That's something that you can definitely do as well. You can also rotate the build. You can move it to a different lot. As long as it's bigger than a 30 by 20, you're fine, but nothing smaller than that. You can also move this little gazebo thing that I have here anywhere on the shell, just make it something. It could be a gazebo, it could be a little garden shed, it could be something whatever you want to do. But in case you want to like put more creativity to the shell, you definitely can 100% add more boxes or whatever you want to do um, against the shell, like not touching my wall, but outside of the shell itself like this. You can do that if you want to. Um, like for me, what I did is I moved it to Zulani based on the career that I had chosen, which is a conservation career. And I honestly love that idea. So moving it to Zulani was like a good idea for my story that I chose, which I will explain in a speed build later this week. 
But for the shell itself, there are two required objects that you have to use. The hot dog painting with tap water that looks like rainbows, and also Baby Yoda. Because who does not love a good old fashioned Baby Yoda? We all do. So that is pretty much it for the entirety of the shell. Like I said, you have to choose a career. Based on that career, make a story out of it, however you want. And based on that story and that career, you have to put it all together and implement it into the shell. And if you wanna find it and you cannot find it on the gallery, all you gotta do is type in the hashtag spring shallow on the gallery. It'll pop up. It'll be right here, which is also right there. My good old fashioned origin ID is spring sims. So either way, origin ID, spring sims, or the hashtag spring shallow. The challenge ends on May 22nd and I'll be doing tours on the 23rd on twitch.tv forward slash spring sims. And so make sure you follow me there so I can tutor your build and I can see all the things in the world of your creativity and your story. And if you do happen to follow me on Twitch and you do the shell challenge, make sure you include your Twitch ID in your description just so I know who it is and I can kind of see what's what. I can definitely see a lot of other builds on here already. Find me Nuggets, Jason, Anthony, Dab, my good old friend Dab. We all see you here. We see a lot of people already here. So if you do a shell challenge of mine, make sure you do it in time on May 22nd, which is the end date, two words on the 23rd. You're good to go. But that being said, I hope you guys already enjoyed like this explaining video of our shell challenge for this month. Like I said, career themed. So pick a career in The Sims 4, put a story, get that story and implement it in this shell and upload to the gallery. All things are down below in the comments and in the description. And yeah, so I hope you guys enjoyed it and I will see you guys all in the very next video. Bye.